Hello, welcome to Boat Dome. My name is Ray. I'm going to give you a quick rundown on the installation of your Boat Dome. You're going to receive a paper set of instructions. They're going to give you a rundown on exactly your starting position. No matter what boat, size, or the model cover you, you pick, whether it be your 10 foot, your 12 foot, your 14, or your 15. All the measurements are going to start from your back, the aft of the boat, or from the bow. When doing the Explorer model, of course, you're going to start from the bow, and your, your measurements will coordinate on back and give you where to start your pilot holes. And in this case, we're going to be starting with our intruder model. We're going to go ahead and pull the measurements on this here, which are going to be 19 and a half, 43 and a half and 113 and a half, starting from the aft of that boat. In this situation here, with your black marker pen, you're gonna go ahead and pull that measurement and mark your mark at 19 and a half. The next one is at 43 and a half. And then at 113 and a half, you're gonna put a mark right on the top of the gunnel. You can use anything from an eighth inch hit bit or a 3 16 or whatever, just a proper size pilot hole. Now, anticipate that this pole is going to be coming in at an angle. So you don't want to drill your hole right in the middle. You want to actually have it at just on the inside of center, as you can see. going to go ahead and follow that up with a half inch don't ream out the hole too much Be a precisely half inch. I've already got the other side pilot drilled. half-inch bushings. Simply put them in place and snap in. Follow those steps up on the other side. Just like so. That's going to allow for the pole insertion, which is going to be the next step of your cover. Felt that.
Okay, the next step, after we've inserted our nylon bushings, is to insert our poles. Each pole is marked with your Velcro for your cross-secting. After you get it in there, you're ready to move on to the next step and install the cover. You can see that goes there. Simply throw your cover over the top, stretch it down on all four sides, find your seam area and where it flaps over in the proper area, put a piece of masking tape to hold in place on all four corners. After all four corners are in place, put some pieces in the middle to hold down as well. Then coordinate exactly where the snaps are in the cover, mark your side gunnel, drill an eighth inch pilot hole, and install the stainless steel studs supplied. After that, you're done. You snap off your cover, and it's ready to be used right now. sides. Go ahead and fold in half, fold over, and just roll it up. Simple as that. You have some quick ties to hold in place. You're ready to go. Enjoy your boat, Tom.